Hello princesses! Today I'm going to be talking about the Secret Key Snow White Milky Pack and Cream. Both of these products are designed to whiten and brighten your skin tone. I'm not really interested in whitening my skin anymore, but I am interested in brightening up a lot of the scars on the sides of my cheeks and that's why I purchased these products. For the Snow White Milky Pack, the instructions say just apply and wash out. This whitening pack will brighten your complexion. Its quick absorption will not make it rub off onto clothes and its smooth texture will make application very easy. Whitening agent niacinamide will multiply the whitening effects. It will provide moisture to keep skin soft and relieve irritated skin. Your skin will look most natural and brilliant, making you look more beautiful. Your skin will look and feel brighter with continued use. The Milky Pack comes housed in a sturdy plastic squeeze tube. There's a surprisingly large amount of the pack because you can actually use this on your entire body. The pack has quite a thin consistency and it's really easy to spread on the body or face. It doesn't seem like it's water soluble, which makes this pack really weird to remove. I've seen a lot of before and afters that have really dramatic results, but all it really is is that the pack leaves a white residue on the skin when it's not fully removed. When I removed this pack from my skin properly, I did not notice any immediate whitening results like the pictures showed. The instructions say that you're supposed to leave this pack on for a couple of minutes and wash it off gently, but since it isn't really water soluble, there's no way that you're going to get this off without using a face cloth and actually scrubbing it off your skin. This pack contains an niacinamide, which is a really good brightening agent for the skin. It does work slowly over time, so I wouldn't think that if you left a mask on for 3 minutes that the niacinamide would have enough time to work. I do not particularly like to use this pack because I feel like it leaves a residue on my skin, which I find just really weird and uncomfortable, and it also does dramatically whiten your skin if you are going to leave the residue on, and it just looks really ghostly and odd. Next up is the Snow White Cream. This cream provides healthy complexion for dull or makeupless skin for a bright and luminous look. Applies lightly on the skin without oily or sticky sensation for soft and lustrous skin. Also, whitening agent niacinamide suppresses the formulation of melanin for gorgeous skin tone. Soft moisture is delivered deep into the skin for energetic, resilient skin. In place of the thick base makeup, just use Snow White Princess Cream for beautiful skin. It's an all-in-one makeup that needs no other. It will adhere closely to sebum to prevent oiliness, making the need for makeup retouching not as frequent. Also, it prevents pores from enlarging due to sebum for baby-like skin. Natural amino acid moisturizer from Sugar Beets provides suppleness and resilience to skin. The Snow White Cream comes packaged in an adorable but not so secure plastic jar. I love that the jar is plastic because if I drop it, it'll bounce rather than shatter, but the lid doesn't look like it seals very well, so I need to replace the inside cap every time I use this cream. This cream does come with a little spatula, which I love. It means that the cream stays hygienic and doesn't get under my long nails. This cream has a really interesting texture. It's super soft and almost melts like butter when being spread. It has a very distinct scent, almost like soft baby powder scent. I don't mind this at all, but fragrances can be irritating to sensitive skin. This cream does leave a white cast on my face, which is kind of what it claims to do. However, if I use too much of this cream, I find that it pills off my skin in little balls and it just looks really terrible. It claims to control oil and help my makeup stay longer, but I haven't seen any results like that. I actually do like to use this cream because my face is a shade darker than my neck due to my hair protecting my neck and not my face. I can see a very small difference when I use this on my face, it does make my skin look maybe half a shade lighter. It is a little bit of a pain though because you need to make sure that it is rubbed very thoroughly into your skin. I found that bit stuck to my eyebrows and you just saw little like bits of white around the eyebrow hairs which is not an attractive look. I love that the packaging of both of these products are pretty cute. I love that the cream comes with a hygienic spatula so that I can get the cream out and that it lightens my face by a half a shade. 
I do not love that the cream is highly fragranced, which can be quite irritating. It has unstable packaging that needs to be sealed very tightly, otherwise it will go off quicker. If you use too much cream, it can result in flaking and pilling on the skin. The cream needs to be thoroughly patted into the skin, otherwise you can see it on your skin. The cream doesn't control excess sebum or oil, and it doesn't make makeup look better on the face or last longer. To be quite honest, I'm not fussed with either of these products. I do not like that they promote having white skin as being the most beautiful skin because I simply do not think that that's true. So for my final thoughts, I don't like the Milky Pack at all. It does whiten the skin, but it does it by leaving residue on the skin which I find really weird and it doesn't suit my skin at all, it makes it feel really gross. I think that it would work to lighten and brighten the skin because it does contain niacinamide which is well known to do that, but since it does leave the residue on the skin I just don't want to use it. The cream does work well because it does lighten the skin up to a half a shade, but it is a bit of a pain to use. You have to be really careful when using it not to use too much and to make sure that it's patted in absolutely everywhere. I would recommend the Milky Pack to any princesses that are looking to dramatically whiten their skin and don't mind having a residue left on the skin. I would recommend the cream for any princesses looking to lighten their skin by a half a shade and don't mind having a very particular cream to apply. Thank you so much for watching this review and I'll see you next time.